what is the first thing that comes to your mind when designing a house a strong foundation through which the pillar goes high above the ground when the concept of roof doesn't exist and the walls are airy only way the structure can survive is by building and rebuilding they spend their lifetime building rebuilding catching prey mating reproducing and even perishing on their own webs here i introduce my neighbor yellow bagged spiny orb weaver and narrate my experience of sharing a space with them so we build our dens well grounded long lasting low maintenance and as a once in a lifetime investment on the other hand the orb weavers weave their nest pretty much every single day and the strength of the spider silk is comparable to that of a high grade alloy steel the given weight of spider silk is 5 times as strong as the same weight of steel these beings are no less engineers when it comes to web building the process begins with gliding a line on the wind to earn the surface it continues to make y by securing the former string and dropping another line from the center rest of the structure is developed using many radii of non sticky silk and a final spiral of a sticky capture silk the sticky silk is what helps our friend to capture the prey spiders produce silk from a body organ called spinneret usually on the underside of a spider's posterior part you will be surprised to know that the silk produced is actually a liquid composed of a protein that hardens as a result of being drawn out After all the spinning and construction our spiny sits at the center of the orb usually with the head facing downward here patience is the key no matter what comes your way or how strong the winds are one has to remain well grounded and sturdy hard work will definitely be rewarded My younger spiny too has got hold of something to feast upon. Oops. Not anymore. Even though our spiny appears a bit disappointed. Guess he's strengthening his web. for a better trap next time failure today stronger tomorrow <laughs>